Hey guys, what's up? So it is Wednesday and I'm not going to upload a video today because I told you I'm going to be doing it twice a week, but maybe not for a while. Do you know why? I might have to do one video video a week if you're lucky. If I'm lucky, more like, because oh, my computer broke. My computer, this piece of junk. Actually, I love this computer. It's, been, it's the reason I've been uploading videos uh, ever since the beginning, but it finally shit the bed on me. I poured water on it last night, and I guess it went, I tried to dry it off real quick, right? And I read all this stuff on the, on my phone about maybe fixing it. I put it upside down so the water would leak out, and I tried getting all the water out, and it won't work. It's It's busted. And I read something online that said, if you get water on your computer, you're pretty much fucked. <laughs> if it gets on the circuit board, then that means that your computer is pretty much useless. Because if you're gonna buy another circuit board, you might as well just buy a new computer because that's how expensive it is. So I have to wait until I can get a new computer. I've been applying for jobs and uh, hopefully I will get one of, the, one of those jobs. Uh, this place, like Kelly Services or whatever, is helping me out, trying to get my application out there so I can get employed, and then get money, and then pay for all this shit that I need to make videos. So maybe once a week, I'll be able to make a video for you guys. Sorry. Because I have my dad's computer, but, you know, everything was on my other computer. And his computer isn't very friendly with uh, editing. I know MacBook Airs are, are like notoriously bad for making videos. And they are, they're slow as fuck. But my dad's computer is an iMac, but his computer for some reason is really slow. It's extra slow, I don't know why. But someone, okay, this is off topic. Someone was asking me earlier about, on my other videos, about the Bioshock giveaway and, oh yeah, look at my Bioshock shirt. Incinerate! Yeah, it's sick. Okay, so, yeah, I have everything planned out, alright? So, on the 17th, when the giveaway ends, I'm going to go through the hundreds of emails that I got, and, uh, you know, put them all on cards, and put them in bowls, and do that whole whole spiel, and I'm going to put it on a video, and I'm, I'm going to upload that on my gaming channel, and I'm going to show you guys who won, and whoever wins first prize is going to get this big box of goodies. And, and then I'm going to send out second, third, and fourth prize as well. And so that, that's going to happen. Oh, look, I got this Wicked Cool Lou test poster. And then I have that big-ass Bioshock one. And so, yeah, that is what's going on with me right now. My freaking computer is dead. So I'm going to be reading a lot of Game of, Th Game of Thrones. One, two, three. And then I have the big ass, the big ass one. The Dance of Dragons. Ah, I'm only on the, I'm only on the first one, but, uh, I'm pumped to read them because the first one is so good and I'm kind of it's just weird that I'm I've waited so long to do to like start to re start reading them. I know I said that last vlog, <laughs> but it's really what's uh got me excited. Oh, and have you guys played the game Borderlands 2? That game is awesome, right? So, I uh just got wind that my friend started to play again, and he called me, and he said, Yo, homie, I am playing Borderlands 2, and since all the DLC is out, you should start playing it with me again. And I'm like, oh yeah, that'd be cool. So I go to look for it, and my Borderlands 2 disc is gone. Someone either stole it, or I lost it, or something. So I had to go out and buy a new one. But that's cool because I had enough points on my GameStop card to get a $20 coupon to save me money. And I also bought the Batman game, Batman Arkham City, because I never played that. I played Arkham Asylum, which was fucking awesome.
but I've never played Arkham City, so I got that to play through. So I'm pretty pumped about that. Oh, I'm so mad that I... Uh, that my freaking computer broke, so now I have to use my dad's iMac, which is right there, and make videos on that, which is annoying because my parents use that computer, so I won't have as much time during the week to edit my videos. You see? I don't have enough as much time, so when my parents come home at around 6 p.m., that's when I have to get off the computer, when normally I would have all night to edit. And I like doing editing at night, and doing editing in the morning is weird, but I could do that. We'll see how everything works out. I might be able to do the two videos a week, maybe. Maybe. I will definitely do one video a week. I will try my hardest. And these vlogs will keep coming because they're easy to make. I just, you know, walk around, talk, and then I upload them on the interwebs. And then it's done. <laughs> That's it. Oh, and by the way, I went to Saraku Japan earlier, which is like a food place at the mall. Saraku Japan. You would expect Japanese people to be working there, right? And doing their like, ting, 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 with their like, their hats and everything. There were like three Mexican guys working there, speaking Spanish to each other, and they took forever to make my food. I, when I went there before, there were three Japanese people working there. I got my food like that, okay? It just, it was instant, okay? I don't know what happened. I guess they quit or something. And now I have these slow, slow cooks. And they just sit there and stare at it and talk in Spanish, so they're probably making fun of me or something while I'm sitting there all impatient. Mm, where's my food? <laughs> uh, annoying, but whatever. I don't have anything against Mexican people. I would just, you know, rather have Japanese people make my Japanese food. Is that wrong? I don't think so. So, this is the third vlog I've recorded today because the other ones I just got, you know, it was mainly just silence because I couldn't think of what to say. Uh, but this one's going well, so I'm going to upload this one. Um, I hope you guys have a good day. I hope you guys had a uh, good day yesterday and a good day tomorrow, just in case I don't upload a vlog tomorrow because who knows what the future will bring. Nobody does. Maybe I'll be dead tomorrow. That would suck, right? <laughs> oh, I hope I didn't jinx myself. Alright, so I'm gonna go either play Borderlands with my friend or uh, possibly read more Game of Thrones because that is an awesome book. Awesome books, okay? I'm thinking about crafting a... Uh, Ooh, this is nice lighting right here with the bookcases and everything. Maybe I could do videos in here. This could be where I do my vlogs. Ooh, this is a good idea. So I could set up a chair here, and then the bookcase, like books in the background are, are good, I feel like. Those those are good uh, back pieces. I don't, I don't like just wall, you know? What, what was I saying? Shit. Oh yeah, okay, so I like tattoos that I know I said I was talking about tattoos the other day, but I've been thinking about a tattoo I want, and uh, it's gonna be like a mesh of Game of Thrones, Battlestar like Infinite, Iron Chick, uh, like all my favorites of certain things. And I was thinking maybe I could have like, but I don't know if if I would like it as a mesh. But meshes are awesome. I was thinking maybe I could have like the the. Uh, like the, uh, what is it called? The Iron Throne? Yeah, the Iron Throne with like Booker sitting on it or something. And then, like the songbird in the background. And then, uh, in the background you would have something else. Maybe a fern. I don't know. I'm gonna do some sketches. And, uh, hopefully they look cool. And, I don't know. A lot of people don't like doing this. They like getting like single tattoos of, of something that they like. You know, like, like I see a lot of people who get uh, certain tattoos of, like, like this one, for example, right there. 
the Heartogram or whatever. Not a Heartogram, that's a... That's an Alkaline Trio tattoo. The first tattoo I ever got. And, uh, it's just the logo of their band. Because I really, really, really love their band. And, uh... It was, it's just that tattoo, you know? It's not like a mesh or anything. And a lot of people do that. They're like, oh, I want to get a tattoo of this. So I get that tattoo. But I like meshes. I like, like, you know, so it's more personalized to me, you know? So it's, I like that a lot. So anyway, I'm going to think of stuff. Maybe, maybe sketch some things. And I want to buy, oh, because remember, I'm going to have this clothing company where I'm going to like draw monsters and put them on shirts and maybe sell them through my channel as like my own clothing line uh yeah i was i want to buy a uh a drawing pad because i got a a uh one of those one of those tablet things i don't know what they're called but you don't you you use it to draw but you have to look at the computer while you're drawing on it and it's really disorienting, I don't like it that much. I want a tablet that I can draw on, like an iPad, but not an iPad, like an, I forget what it's called. It starts with a K. But anyway, I want one of those so I can uh, mess around and draw some sweet stuff and then put them on shirts. And I'm gonna do it so it's a shirt that I, I would actually like to wear, you know? And uh, not like, I don't want to do basic, you know, Tyler Rand shirts, you know? Maybe I'll do, like, one of those. But I don't like it when people, they're like, Oh, this is my clothing. Go check it out at districtlines.com. And all their clothes are just, you know, pictures of them. Or uh, just, you know, their name on a shirt. And that's it. And it's like, oh, that's really not cool. Olin Rogers has you know, his own clothing that he, he's really personalized and made and awesome with like, with like creative sayings that he's made up and, uh, and cat shirts and they're just really cool. Uh, I'm going to do something a little bit different, like, uh, like monsters because it's going to be called Monstrum, my clothing line. And then, uh, because I don't want it just to be like a Tyler, Tyler Rand apparel. No. <laughs> I want it to be like a separate thing, but you know, I'm, I'm gonna like promote it through my channel. So yeah, that's something to think about for me. And I hope you guys have a good day. I'll talk to you tomorrow on Thursday and I'll let you know if there will be a video on Friday. And if there will be, oh, give me ideas for a video because I lost pretty much all of my ideas <laughs> in my, through my computer dying, so if you have any ideas, you know, comment down below and tell me something that you'd like to see on that channel, and I will see if I can upload that. So yeah, I will see you guys on Thursday. Alright, see ya.